Coco Tsurumi is leading after the last rotation. She goes up onto beam. How they manage to keep their composure on this is beyond me. <laughs> hours and hours of practice. And she's a tiny little gymnast and starts with a very high jump. One of the most difficult jumps. And the free walk over straight into the backflip and layout somersault. She's fulfilled the judges' requirements of linking acrobatic elements. Now the half turn into the forward walk over. The gymnasts have to show at least three dance moves and only five acrobatic moves in these routines. The uh, judges have tried to make it a little bit less acrobatic, but she's showing both very well. She's done two difficult jumps. And there she goes again, links the moves confidently and well. Another skill she has to include is the spin and holds that leg up confidently. She was tight. She wasn't letting it go. Now, just the big dismount. It has to be difficult to get maximum marks. She makes the round off, lifts, two and a half twists. It's a difficult dismount and well performed. What a piece for Coco. She qualified for the Olympic beam final. <laughs> She looks over the moon with that, I tell you what, deservedly so as well. Sarumi so goes into the lead with 14.8. What about this halfway round? Let's keep the focus, Coco.